Golden Retriever. Oh, that's so... That's funny. That's funny. That's freaking... Um, that's clever. That's very clever. I like that. Golden Retriever. And you're retrieving the... Oh. What's up, Gold Diggers? This is KJ48. And welcome to a brand new Let's Play for Gold Rush. All right. So what is Gold Rush, you might be asking? Well, I'll read straight from the Steam page here. Become a gold, gold miner. Work hard. Dig deep. Explore the world. And you'll become the wealthiest man in Alaska. Well, I don't know about working hard or digging deep, but I do like the wealthiest man part. Use a variety of highly detailed machines uh, to find as much gold as you can. Sounds awesome. Uh, I played this for about an hour, and it's really cool. You start off, like, pan, like, using a pan to try and get gold dust, and uh, eventually you can get workers and stuff for yourself. So let's go ahead and start playing, man. Uh, this game seems really, really cool. Very different from some of the stuff I normally play on this channel, but you're going to find some very, if you're a fan of survival games, you're going to find some very familiar hooks in this game um, that kind of come with the zombie, uh, the, not only the zombie survival genre, but the survival genre, uh, you know, in general, okay? Um, I actually wish they'd make you eat, drink, and, and use the bathroom and have to sleep. I don't know. You might have to sleep. I don't really know yet, but we're going to kind of see how that goes. Alright, so, um, look for a guide. Alright, there are two ways to get info about our in-game systems. First is the journal. Yeah, I know about the journal. Second one is DigTube, our library of movies about the game. Sounds really cool. Don't show this message again. Alright, so DigTube is right here. You can, like, kind of watch videos on a lot of stuff. We'll do that as needed. This is what I really like here, this journal. It's going to tell you what to do uh, to get started. Alright, and we're going to look around really quickly. The game looks uh, kind of good, kind of good. It's it's got the realistic look. It's um it's a pretty good looking game. I don't know if I'm running it on max uh, max settings or anything either. If you look at the top right hand side, it's 8:05 in the morning, day one. We have 220 dollars and 0 .035 ounces of gold. Okay, so it looks like we've got a truck here. I'm assuming this is my truck, and we have to go to the bank. Let's take a look at the map here. All right, we're right here, and the bank is right here on the left. So let's get to that escape. Yes, escape. So let's get in the truck. Um, let's show the controls. All right, so we've got next. I like next camera. There we go. All right, so um, drive uh, handbrakes. Okay, so we got headlights, handbrakes, engine. All right, so we got to press X for the engine. All right, that starts it up. I already hit the handbrake, so we should be good now. All right, and um, it looks like our our energy. Our, it looks like our fuel is going up for some reason. I'm not quite sure exactly why our fuel would be going up. Maybe it's just going up to show you, you have half a thing of fuel. All right, so we're going to go right here, right next to the bank, just kind of park here. All right, we're going to go ahead and hit the handbrake. We're going to turn off the engine. We're going to get out of the truck. Um, get out of the truck, E, right? Yes, okay. And we're going to go to the bank, all right? So let's walk over here to the bank. Let's hide the controls. And let's see what's going on with the bank. All right, so we've got Old Glen Bank. So it looks like there's a couple places we could go with. We can go with Rivertown, uh, Pine Valley, or old Arnold parcel. I think we don't have anywhere near that much money. Um, older old Arnold is always happy when new wannabe miners are coming to town. He was a miner for most 40 years and now he teaches everyone who wants to listen. Um, he rents his claim almost for free. Um, come take a look yourself. Okay, so this gives me a price, but I'm guessing that's a buy price. By the way, we also have loans, stock. That's like how much gold is selling for. And you could sell gold bars right there. Anyway, um, I don't know about the rent. Do you guys see where it says anything about it? I'm not sure what he rents it for, but we're going to go ahead and rent it. All right, so now it's rented. Maybe maybe when they said almost for free, they meant totally for free. <laughs> All right, so we're going to look in the journal. The journal told us to go to the bank, and that's what we have to do. We need to rent the old Arnold uh, parcel claim, and then we need to go to the warehouse. The warehouse, I believe, is down that way. Yeah, we have to go ahead and get in this. Why can't I move? Um, okay. There we go. Got to go ahead and get in this thing. I don't know if this is an early access game. I don't think it is. Um, but it's still pretty buggy. Uh, they got some work to do on it. But I'm having a good time. Whoa. Go forward, buddy. There you go. I'm having a good time with it, though. It's pretty cool. Um, I really enjoy it. And like I said, you know, you might look at... I keep hitting the brake. You should disable different lock when you drive on... Okay, so I got to disable some kind of lock here. Different lock cue. Okay. You should disable different lock when you drive an asphalt. I don't know. I guess that's fine. All right, so let's go ahead and back up in here. This game's very realistic. You don't have an inventory, okay? That's very important you guys understand that. No inventory, okay? So what we're going to do is we're going to come on in here. All right, I'm parking here for a specific reason. And remember, no inventory. 
Alright, so we're gonna come in here. So, I'm here. What do you want me to buy? Okay, let's take a look at the journal. Uh, buy a hog pan, no pump. Hog pan sluice, sluice box core. Two hog pan mats and a bucket. Well, okay. Hog pan, no pump. Hog pan, no pump. I think that's right over here. Yeah, it's one of these things. Hog pan pump. Hog pan, no pump. There we go. We will buy one. Storage slots. I'm not sure what quite that means, but um, total cost. There we go. And then uh, sluice box core. What was it? Was it a sluice box core or... No, it was a core. Let me make sure. I don't want to buy the wrong thing. Um, hog pan sluice box core. Hog pan... Okay, there we go. Let's go ahead and buy one of those. Then we're going to need two mats. I forget where the... Oh, they're right here. It's nice that they put all the stuff in the right area. We're going to need two of those. Okay. And then uh, what was the last thing? A bucket? Two buckets? Just one bucket. Okay. And I had, I had trouble finding the buckets last time I played... Um, let me see if I can... F oh, here we go. Alright, one bucket. Now you might be wondering, wait, where's my inventory? Where's my stuff? Where'd everything go? First of all, did I buy everything? Oh, yeah, we have to go to the thing. You got all your stuff lined up here. And you just go ahead and buy. Now you might be asking, uh, your stuff has been prepared. You will find all... See, this wasn't here yesterday. <laughs> when I played this game yesterday, this wasn't here. You will find all of your ordered stuff just outside the shop in de in a designated area. Yeah, that wasn't there for me, for me last time. So I had to kind of like figure it out. So the stuff is right over here. All right. Now you can't just put the stuff in your inventory. You have to actually pick it up and put it in your truck. So you know, I guess you, you click the button or you hold it down. I forget. Oh, E to pick up. Okay, there we go. Now I don't know if there's a way for me to like turn things. I might want to look into that. But for now, I'll just kind of dump this in here. All right, so that works. Okay, this is really bugged out last time. When I played it the first time, I got this thing in like a weird position and it flew my truck into the air. <laughs> it's, actually, it's actually pretty funny. I wouldn't mind it happening again. All right, so let's go ahead and put that right there. That looks good. I really like this game. I love, love, love the overall um, real realism of not being able to put stuff in a backpack. You know what I mean? Now, I wouldn't want this for all my games. I like Seven Days to Die the way it is. And this might get old after a while, having to move things around one at a time. But so far, I'm really kind of liking it, to be honest. It's tricky, though, to take something like this and make it fun and not be annoyed with it, right? But I'm having a good time with it. So there we go with the mats. There's everything in there. Let's go ahead and put up the tailgate. All right. And uh, I grew up on a farm, so yes, I do know that's a tailgate. Although I guess most people know that. All right. So what do we do next? What do we do next? Journal? Um, load up the pickup truck, go to the claim, set up the hog pan. Okay, so we need to find the claim. And uh, the claim's right down here. So I am going to go there, guys. And uh, this should be pretty entertaining. All right, guys, we got to do some off-roading here. Come right over here. Now I think I need to put it on a different lock, right? I'm not sure what that lock thing means. That little, like, bright red... You see in the bottom right-hand side? It's, it's on, it's off, it's on, it's off. I think it's supposed to be on when you're down here. So we're going to head on over to the mine... And uh, let's see if we can get there in one piece. It would be wonderful if we do not flip our truck. All right, guys, here we are. Welcome to Old Arnold Parcel. Well, you gotta, I'm going to buy this thing eventually. You're going to have to put my name on it. You're going to have to call it KJ48 Parcel. Punks. What do you think about that? Let's take a look at the map to show you where I am. All right, there we are. And I'm going to try and get over to the camp. And uh, we'll see how that goes. All right, guys, here we are safe and sound at the camp. Let's uh, let's check this place out, man. This looks like a little work area over here. Oh, cool, we got a porta potty That's where I go to do my dirty, sinful business. Awesome, awesome. We got a hammer that I can't take. Um, some spool of thread over there. We got some materials over here. I don't know why I can't interact with any of this stuff. I guess it's just here for show. Kind of a bummer. Let's take a look at these houses. Like, what's up with these houses, man? Like, I thought I'd be out here, like, in a tent or something. This is We're, we're living in luxury, man. All right, yeah, it doesn't look like I can go into these houses. That's a bummer. All right, so we got a little uh, little thing and bob over here. We can use it. Oh, that's how you sleep. Okay. No, we don't want to go to sleep. Money. Time's a-wasting. All right, so we got a little fire there. What's this? Oh, just a tree stump. Check out in here. Uh, what do we got? A computer? Oh, okay, here. So you see we get workers. You have to unlock it. Coming soon. Equipment store is coming soon. Failures is coming soon. Machine store is coming soon. Am I sure this game's not in early access? <laughs> I don't think... Th I didn't see early access on the Steam page, guys, but I didn't study the Steam page. Um, I'll let you know more about early access next video because I didn't think it was early access, but who knows. Alright, shut it down. 
Can we interact with anything else? Um, okay, so we can pick that up. That's what. That's a pan thingy we're gonna have to uh, pan for gold with. And I don't see anything else we can we can uh, work with in here. All right, let's come outside. Let's take a look at the journal. We need to uh, set up the hog pan. Okay, go to the claim. Okay, so I think we have to set this hog pan up over here somewhere. Yeah, maybe like right here. That's probably where we have to set up the hog pan. So what we want to do is we want to kind of get the truck as close to, as possible to this thing uh, to minimize the amount of back and forth we're going to have to do while carrying stuff. Okay, that's that's the thing with these games. I've played some other games in the past, like... Um, what was that game I played? Uh, I don't remember, but I've played some other games in the past where it was super realistic and you had to like carry stuff around all the time. But the problem is they didn't give you the tools that you needed. This game does. It gives you a truck, which is actually really nice. All right, that's close enough. Oh, let's get back in and shut off the engine. There we go. Yeah, that should be close enough. All right, guys, I've got everything out. Let's see if we can uh, get this to work. So let's pick up this thing and put it right on these this wood. Yep, there. See, it's got the little outline. There we go. And then we put this big thing on there too. Yeah, I'm some I'm some prospector, right? Put this thing on that thing, and let's do this thing. Then we're gonna take these mats, and we put the mats in here. And the idea is you put the idea is you put the dirt in here, right? And then you pour water into it, and it kind of pulls the dirt through here. And I guess the gold um, gets caught up by the mats, and all the water and dirt comes out, but the gold gets left behind. At least that's the idea. All right. Oh, oh, so we got some things here. So that right there is how much dirt you have in it. These are the mats. The mats can get dirty and you have to clean them up. And um, I think that's it. I think I have to do some shoveling now. But I'm not quite sure to shovel because I didn't see a shovel. and didn't tell me to buy one either. All right, guys. I went back in my uh, base and got the, uh, the pan here. Now, that's kind of weird. All right. With all of the realism this game has, having to move everything around, how come I have a shovel on me? Like, and a, and a flashlight? I mean, I, I don't know. I guess the shovel's pretty small, so that's fine. All right, so let's see how we dig here. Do we just, uh, there we go, and we do this. There we go. All right, so that's 10%. So you probably have to dig like 10 times to fill this thing up. Um, it's left click to dig with the shovel, and it's E to put the to put the dirt in there. I'm going to fill it up like half, and we'll see what it does. Um, just because I want to get going. It's already uh, uh, 1336, so. 49% uh, sounds good. All right, so let's uh, get rid of this. By the way, the way to, to cycle through your items is the... Um, the period and the comma, which is kind of weird, but okay. All right, so we come over here and we drop it in the water. No, that's not what we want it to do. We um, press, oh, you have to wait until the water's lit up and then press E. Okay. Then you bring it over here and you dump it in there. And there we go. All right. Come to Papa. Give me all the, oh, I saw some gold. Oh, I saw some gold. Can we duck? Why can't we duck? So is that all the, so, um, that's all the dirt? Nope, there's still a little bit of dirt. Now you can see right here, the mats are being used up a little bit. Um, let's go ahead and put a little bit more dirt in there. There we go. Man, I think I'm really going to like this game. I love the idea of coming in here with basic tools and, you know, just having to like do this old school, you know? And then like, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm sure I'll eventually get big machinery and a big company. I watched a... Gold Diggers, or, sorry, Gold Diggers. Uh, Gold Rush is a game, or is a TV show apparently on Discovery Channel. As a matter of fact, I think this was made by Discovery Channel because uh, in the uh, home screen, you see a little Discovery Channel icon on the top right hand side. If it wasn't made by them, they definitely, are, you know, had to, someone had to buy the license, I guess. Um, and I actually watched some of it today and uh, it looks pretty interesting. I noticed some of the people in it, you know, it looks, looks pretty funny. So, um, I don't know if funny is what they're going for, but, you know, it is what it is. Uh, so, yeah, that's what this is all about. And, um, I don't know. You know, like, starting from these, like, meager beginnings and building up is all about progression. And I'm a big fan of progression in games. It's probably my... The thing I love the most about games is progression. All right, come on, come on, come on. Where's my gold? Where's my gold? There's some gold. I saw it. I saw it. I saw some gold. All right. So, the mats are at 3%. So let's just, uh, let's use up the rest of the dirt we have in there <clears throat> and then we'll, um, and then we'll go ahead and we'll, uh, we'll clean out the mats and we'll do some panning. All right, come on. Give me the gold. There's some gold. Yeah. Come on. Give me gold. Oh, look at this. Golden retriever. Oh, that's so, that's funny. That's funny. That's freaking, um, that's clever. That's very clever. I like that. Golden retriever and you're retrieving the, oh, just kudos kudos that might be my favorite thing in the game yet that they named the thing golden retriever all right the dirt is all out 
And we got a little bit more gold in there. Okay, so let's wait for this to finish up. And I don't know if you have to wait for the finish. Yeah, there we go. And detach. And then I think you gotta like clean these or something. But I think you need I think you need water in there first. So let's put this back. And let's put some water in this. So I think this goes in here. And you kind of like wash out the, the dirt or the uh, the dirt or some of the dirt and some of the... Oh, now it's at four. No, it, that's number two. The one I just put in there was number two. Oops. Put that back. There we go. And we wash out a little bit more. And I'm guessing the idea is the gold is in that bucket. All right, guys. I went, my, I went back in my tent and I found this big old... I don't know what it, what it's called. This big old container here. So I think what you do is you dump... I don't know if you can wash out the, um, the mats in this thing or not. But... I'm going to dump the bucket in here. Why is it in use? Oh, there we go. Okay, so that works. Oh, there we go. WASD to tip. Oh, we got some gold there. All right, so we want to get these little nuggets out of here. Not the nuggets, but the um, the little crappy parts. And you want to keep, obviously, the gold in there. Okay. I don't know if you have to get all this stuff out. I'm not really sure how to get the gold here. Shift. There we go. See? And then, oh, you, yeah, so it's kind of like dust. You kind of like pick it up in the bottle. So I think that's it for this one. So let me, um, let me go ahead and get out of this. How do I get out of this? I forget. E, there we go. Let's go ahead and put this down. Let's try that again. I think I figured it out, but it might have been a little bit, um, hard for you to follow because I was learning it as we went. So let's, uh, let's continue. Okay. So we got the gold in, in that water. So let's pick this up and put it down. And then we pick this up and then we put it on top. That'll pour some water into there. Okay. And uh, a bunch of the materials that I got from those uh, pans. So then we pick this up. We come over here. We press E. And yes, yeah, so we could shake with the mouse. And so we got we to get some water in here. And then shake it with the mouse. I don't know what that does. Dump some of the water out. WASD is moving it left, right, and forward and stuff like that. Oh, there we go. We got a nugget right there. I can see it. Come on. Come on. Get out of there. Get out of there. Uh, all right, let's get. Some, I don't know what getting water in does for you. I don't know what shaking it up either does for you, but we'll learn. We'll learn as we go. Maybe it separates the um. Maybe it separates the the dirt from the gold. There we go. Now, can I get it now? Uh, doesn't look like it. There we go. Got it. All right, now we're up to 0 0.052 ounces. Let's see if there's any more in there. No, I don't see any more. Okay, all right, fair enough. Get some more water in there. I don't know, maybe that'll do something. Oh, it's all gone. All right, we're done with that. All right, we got it. can we dump this out? Do you have to dump it out in there? Let's see, let's just dump it out just to make sure. Uh, there we go, get all the water out of it. All right, well, I think that's what we do to get some gold. I don't know if I'm doing this right. Um, I'm getting some gold. I don't, maybe I'm not doing it the best way. I don't know. I think that's empty now. Nope, it's still got some stuff in there. All right, so come to here. And so I don't see any gold in there now. <clears throat> so I think the water might bring the gold out, possibly. There we go. Shake that up. Shake it up like it ain't no thing. <clears throat> oh, I see one. Okay. So what does putting the water in there and shaking it do for you guys? I'm not sure. I'm thinking that may, might, like, shake the gold out of the dirt that's already in there. Because I'm only getting one nugget here. There you go. Get out of here. That might... Oh, yeah, that's good enough. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So I think maybe I have to shake, shake the dirt a little bit more. If you guys know, let me know in the comments because this is obviously <laughs> very new to me. All right, so let's bring this over here. So I've only gotten one piece all these times. So let me uh, do a lot of shaking this time and see if I get more pieces by doing that. All right, so this is done. I could put this over here. Okay, let's bring this over here. All right, so there's definitely no nuggets in there right now. So I think the idea is to get some water... And to shake. Shake, 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 shake. I don't know how much I'm supposed to shake. I see one nugget right now. So should I be doing this for a while? Or... I don't know. Alright. 
Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Okay. What is that? What is that silver looking thing? And I don't see a nugget. What the hell happened to the nugget? I know I saw a nugget in there. And now it's... Did I lose it? Nope, I see it. Uh, uh, I think I see it. Maybe I'm just seeing things. Yeah, I don't know. Alright, let's give it some more water. Okay, there we go. There's one. So I wonder if that silver piece was like a nugget... That was like like coming out, and I just need a little more shaking. There we go. All right, we're up to point six seven. Yeah, I don't know. I I, I might be doing something wrong. I'm not really no. Uh, suggestions in the comments are more than welcome. Let's do. Uh, actually, you know what? We're just about out. All right, guys, got a bunch of dirt. Filled this thing up. Ran a bunch of water through it, and we should have some good stuff on these mats. Let's see if I can. See, I can't. I can't rinse the mats out in there. Um. So yeah, you got to do it in here. And I believe it's going to need some water. Right? It does need water for you to rinse out the mats, right? Yeah. Maybe. Maybe not. Oops. Hold on. Nope. Yep. See, it needs water. That's what I thought. Okay. So let's go ahead and get some water in here. So I did it right the first time. I did it right the first time. Okay. So you can get rinsed out in there. Come on. Should I be rinsing out both mats, one right at, like together in the same bucket? Or is that like wasting like material? See, I don't know. I'm going to have to find all this stuff out. Not a lot of people I know are doing Let's Plays on this game. Alright, so let's put this right in here. Okay, put that down. Pick this up. Come on over here. Now right now there's no nuggets in there whatsoever. So we do have to get the nuggets out by doing this. That's, that's a fact. We have to do this to get the nuggets out. I don't know if it's better in going in a circular motion or, you know, vertical or horizontal. Let's just let some water out. All right, so I definitely see one nugget in there. Can I get the nugget out now? That's what I'm thinking. That's what I'd like to do. Good. Because I want to look for some, no some more nuggets and see if I get any more. All right, so let's do this. And move it like that. Let's get a little bit more. There we go. Shut up, timer. You don't tell me what to do. I'm a, I'm a prospector. I'm getting some gold. Oh, careful, careful. Okay, let's see what we got now. Anything else? Oh, it's getting dark, damn it. I don't see any more gold in there. So that didn't seem to help me out any. Can I take out my flashlight? No. All right. There we go. So can you only get one nugget in these? Like, you know, I mean, we're just digging in the dirt. I, I can't imagine we're going to get a lot of gold doing this. But, I don't know, it feels like it's going really slow. Come on. Anything else? I don't see anything. It's really getting dark. Alright. Not really see anything. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to take all... The oh, boy, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, well, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to take everything inside and continue doing this um, inside because there is some lights. So but we're going to call the video here. Guys, if you have any tips at all, I am all ears. That would be wonderful. If you want to see more of this game, uh, definitely let me know in the comments. Let me know with the thumbs up. Let me know with the views and supporting the video. All right, guys. Thank you very much for watching. I will see you next time. And until then, take it easy.